Hey everyone, it's Saturday, so that means it's my turn to do the accent challenge today. Uh, let's get started. Um, what's your name and username? Uh, name's Mac, McKenzie, Anderson. Uh, same on Facebook, Mac Anderson. Uh, Tumblr, uh, I say anchors away. Twitter. Anchors Away Patches. And where am I from? I'm from Waterloo also, along with Tyler. Pronounce the following words. Aunt, roof, root. I, 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 I say either route or route depending on if I'm on the highway or I'm doing a paper route or route. I, I, I don't know what I normally say. So, Theater, iron, sa salmon, caramel. Fire, water, New Orleans, pecan, both, again, probably, Alabama, lawyer, coupon, mayonnaise, pajamas, I just, I typically call them PJs, so, caught, naturally, aluminum, jiff, tumbler, cracker jack, doorknob, envelope, and GPOY, or, I, I never actually say GPOY or GPOY, I always think gratuitous picture of yourself. I I don't like acronyms that much. What is it called when you throw toilet paper on somebody's houses? TPing. Five. What is a bubbly carbonated drink called? Um I say soda because I got annoyed with saying pop. So I occasionally call it pop, but I typically call it soda. What do you call gym shoes? In my family, we call it tenors for tennis shoes. Even though it's like tennis shoes, but we call it tenna shoes. Where I grew up, what do you call your grandparents? Grandma and Grandpa. I don't have some fancy name for them. Although I kind of wish I did. Never happened. <clears throat> what do you call a wheeled contraption in which you carry groceries at the supermarket? Cart. I call it a cart wherever I'm at. I don't, I don't care where I'm at. It's just a cart. Plain and simple. What is the thing that you change a TV channel with? A remote. I, I actually had a friend that uh, their whole family and them called it a push. I don't know why. They're weird. Uh, choose a book and read a passage from it. Crap, I need to grab a book real quick. I'll be reading from The Darkest Evening of the Year by Dean Koontz. Um, me and my dad are both huge fans of Dean Koontz, so uh, it only really makes sense. Behind the wheel of a Ford Expedition, Amy Redwing drove as, she, as if she were immortal and therefore safe at any speed. In a, faithful, or in a fitful breeze, a funnel of golden sycamore leaves spun along the post-midnight street. She blasted through them, crisp autumn scratching across the windshield. For some, the past of a chain would each day... Sorry, let me repeat that. For some, the past is a chain, each day a link, raveling backwards to one ring bolt or another, in one dark place or another, and tomorrow is a slave of yesterday. Really good book. I recommend it. Do you think you have an accent? On video, I think I do. I sound weird, but when I'm just talking, I don't hear anything. Be a wizard or a vampire? Uh, who would want to be a vampire? For, you know, that's weird. And I'd hate the fact of immortality. I wouldn't know what to do with all that time. Do you know anyone on Tumblr in real life? quite a few. Uh, Tyler lived with them for almost a year, so I kind of have to know him in real life. End audio post and saying any three words. Uh, ah, crap, what?